Draw the creep and recovery curves for the three element model consisting of a Kelvin element and a spring in series. So a Kelvin element is a spring and dash pot in parallel. So this is a Kelvin element. It has a spring and it has a dash pot in parallel. And then we have a three element model uh, which has a Kelvin and a spring in series. So let's say the spring has a Young's modulus of E1, the dash pot has a viscosity of eta1, and the spring, the spring has a Young's modulus of E2. And let's say let's say sigma is a stress. The strain versus time curve would be. If epsilon is a strain, then this is a plot of strain versus time. The graph would start here after the elastic region. We have the Kelvin region and then we have the elastic recovery and then we have the viscoelastic recovery. So this is the elastic region um, for the spring, which is sigma over E2. This is the viscoelastic um, Kelvin region. And then this is the elastic recovery. This is the viscoelastic recovery. So this is a time T one.